What happens when the IRS levies your bank account? After they've given you ad adequate notice that uh, your, your debt, your tax debt is delinquent and you haven't done anything about it, the IRS then has the right to send a notice to your bank. It's called the notice of levy. And it basically tells the bank, this taxpayer account is subject, take, send the IRS all the money in the account up to the amount that they owe. So if there's more money in the account than, than is owed, the, the bank has to send everything that is owed, but leave the rest for the, for the taxpayer. Now, the, uh, the bank has 21 days to hold the, the money so that the taxpayer can dispute whether or not that's a, an appropriate thing, but it basically freezes the account to that amount. The, the, the bank customer, the taxpayer, the next day can deposit money and it's not covered by the levy. So it's a one shot deal. The bank levy is a one shot deal as opposed to a wage garnishment. When the, when the IRS sends a notice to your employer that you owe taxes, that is every time you get a paycheck, it's in effect until you do something to stop the IRS from doing that. 